I love the freedom that, that screen printing allows for me. I get to work from home. I get to be my own boss. I like to think of my customers as my boss. So really technically I have like dozens of bosses. So it can be stressful sometimes, but all in all, I'm, I'm really grateful for the position that I'm at in life to have this way to make an income. Um, I've always been sort of, I, I've always kind of liked my privacy and, and sort of just enjoyed like the atmosphere that I'm allowed to have while I work as a screen printer because you're kind of just in your element. And, Screen printing totally changed my life and it's crazy because I, I literally never imagined that I would even be doing this for a living when I started screen printing. I just wanted to start my own brand and I just wanted to like, I wanted to start a clothing line and collaborate with people and make music and make like merch for my YouTube channel and like all these um, types of things. And then it, it eventually just led into me like realizing like, oh, I can make money printing for other people and I don't have to work at a factory at a job I don't really like. I got into screen printing because I wanted to start a clothing brand and I was really into photography and art. I had a lot of friends who were painters and artists and illustrators and photographers and people who like to model and things like that. I actually found somebody selling their, their old shop out of North Carolina and it was a really great price so I just jumped on it. I, it was just kind of scary to, to take that leap because um, I didn't have that much money saved. but. I knew that it was something that I wanted to do and I, I wanted to make like like a life-changing decision. I wanted to not feel like I had to work the type of job. Dude, I really feel like I'm just scratching the surface. I've been doing this for five years and like I said I started in like the little tiny closet in California which I don't know if you could really call it starting it was me trying to start and then when I got home to, to Cincinnati I started printing out of my basement and now here I am in this giant garage um, and I still think of it as like I'm just starting you know I mean I worked in my basement for like four years or so um, and it was a startup then but it's still a startup now and I think it'll be a startup for a long time because um, I eventually want to get automated equipment um, outside of the embroidery stuff. <laughs>